Carly, voters have an opportunity to vote for funding for the bus system for the next 10 years or vote to end it. Representatives for Cats says this funding is crucial to keep the wheels rolling. The Capital Area Transit System, better known as CATS, funding is once again up for renewal. It's vital and essential. Uh, a majority of our budget comes from, uh, operational budget comes from this millage. Development Director Theo Richards says the money comes from millage property taxes. Rates are based on residents' taxable property value and are paid annually. This is not a, a new tax. This is just a renewal, keeping them at the same rates to ensure that the services that we, uh, we put out 10 years ago and, and since then we could continue to sustain for the next 10 years. In the last three years, CATS have received between 18 to $20 million a year from this measure. But is it enough? We, we, you know, we work with the dollars that we have. Um, you know, this ensures that we're able to keep uh, the buses on the road and not have to shut down service. Um, if for some reason the tax was not renewed, we would have to dramatically reduce services uh, to a point where that, you know, question um, if it would even be worth having a service at that time. CATS has faced scrutiny over the years for poor service, including canceled or delayed trips, to buses breaking down. Richard claims these problems were caused by the pandemic. We have a, had a shortage in operations uh, with operators as well as getting access to parts uh, within a timely fashion to ensure that our vehicles can continue to roll on a daily basis. So Election Day is November 13th. Now, early voting has started this week. To find your polling station, head to our website, brproud.com. Reporting live in Baton Rouge, Ariel Salk, NBC Local 33 News.